Pigeonhole. I'm surrounded. Flock, here. I warned you about this in the last episode. I am here. I'm joined on my left by Style. Are you a Marine now? <laughs> He's surrounded. The whole point of the pigeon was that you were in the Air Force. Yeah, yeah. Well, not anymore, buddy. It's Style. That's him. Howdy. On my right is Shane. Hey, everyone. From Off Air. Hello. On my farther right is Jake, also from Off Air. Hello. So, this is the pigeonhole. Usually, this is a submission based show. Where you submit your stuff. Your submission wrestling. Yeah. Well, I'm, sure. I'm always yeah. Sub- I'm yeah. submitted, dude, all the time. And you usually submit your stuff into the show. It comes out once a month, and we review your stuff. But this time, Style and I have been talking, and it's going to be a little more laid back thing. Okay. Um, but we're just going to be talking about a lot of inside jokes and trying to explain a lot of inside jokes that we have. Ooh. So, ooh. Okay. So that the listeners, and we make a lot of inside jokes on the shows, especially on the Rebel Radio show, especially on Off Air. Mm-hmm. And on the TV right now, uh, there's some confused faces in here. We're just watching Roblox. We're just watching. I don't know what this is. Style put it on. There's just, it's just some Roblox. Yeah. That's good. Some casual background. Yeah, you know? no, it looks some, good. I like some blocks it. in. It's, He's escaping, dude. He's going hard. It's keeping my ADHD brain burning. Burning yeah. real nice. Well, I guess that's a good place to start then, right? With it's real inside brain jokes. Rock. Yeah. Fucking Ned Flanders. <laughs> Oh, the flan, oh, dude. Okay, okay, so, okay. If y'all are familiar with Off Air, listen to it. Um, yeah. There's a there's a bit. No, it's actually not really a it's bit. Kind it's of kind of a lifestyle. It's an unspoken. <laughs> it's an unsp- I feel like it goes unspoken uh, uh, a lot of the time. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. I feel like it's become a lot more spoken the past like handful of recordings. Yeah, I've no, been, it's been I've, spoken. I've been vocal about it. I've been vocal about yeah, it. Why? I've been, I've been afraid to share my There's opinions. There's no need to get vocal about it. Because, listen, I don't like Ned Flanders like that. They show... <laughs> uh, Pidge, why don't you explain what they what they what, do ne- to me okay, okay, so on I'm, these recordings? So sessions. I'm getting this from an outside perspective, because usually I'm away in Arizona, and but I'm the listening. the times that you have I'm, been yeah, here, I, you've I, seen it. I've seen it. I've seen it. You saw it today. I did see it today. We were reviewing it before. We had so, to review the footage. So every time... They didn't tell me about that earlier. Every time we're recording off air... I didn't know that that was going to happen. Style, we got two screens posted up here in the studio, and Style will put up some... Some beautiful visualizers, visualizers yeah. of Ned, and we just like Ned. They're Flanner. not. We they're they're not like, just visualizers. They are. Pitch. What kind of visualizers are they? They're they're Ned. They're, they're like, Ned. They're like, they're like Ned. nothing but Ned. They're Ned buff, <laughs> and like. Well, he is a buff guy. Yeah, uh, listen. No, he's not. Yes, he, is, he is though. Are you fitness yes, shaming Ned Flanders? He's listen. I don't need to see. It's pictures of him like shirtless. Sometimes, most of the time, not all of the time. Yeah, last time it was, and it yeah. was just him going dilly dilly dilly. Yeah, yeah, but I didn't <gasps> like that. What Ned Flanders would you prefer me put up there? None of them. But you have then to choose one. Then why are we one. here? Why are we doing off air ever then? Be not for Ned Flanders. No, oh. dude. In the first meeting, you literally said that you said, "Nope." Of no, all I didn't. the things we do this show for, nope. we do it for Ned. Yeah. No, I didn't. Nope. Nope. You were, you were in Lie. your green. Pullover nope. sweater. Yeah, False with, information. with the pink undershirt. Right. Nope. Yeah. Nope. Nope. That's Scooby Doo. That's some. That's a mystery to me. <laughs> I don't like Ned <laughs> Flanders, and I don't want him up on my screen. Damn it. I don't know where the bit well, started. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, <laughs> I, don't I don't know where that came from. I don't know why you started doing that. Yeah. Started. No, you just pulled it up, and I just went with it. Like it, it just. It was really. It. So, yeah. It was really funny. I, I could be completely wrong. When we were doing like the last recordings of Culturally Relevant, what? Who? When we were doing the last recordings of a show, uh, we <laughs> it was in the other studio, and there's the the monitor in front of Shane while he's recording, but he we tried to use the monitor to pull up like his his uh, bullet points and stuff like that or like slides, but we couldn't get it to work. So eventually, at some point, I was just pulling up like skeletons dancing or random visualizers yeah. and shit like that, right? Yeah. And once we started doing off air, we kind of just had something on the screen. And I want to say the Flanders started because we talked about. No, that wouldn't make any sense. I was gonna say we at one point. I think we talked you just about, did it. I yeah. think you just thrusted this upon me. You thwarted Whoa. this. Well, I know you liked the Ned Flanders show. That's a no. big one. Nope. The Ned Flanders. The it's Flanders. Not it's not called that. The Flanders. Simpson. Flanders movie? The Simpsons the movie. Flanders. It came out all the time. What's the next uh what's the next inside joke? Huh? 
<laughs> so what, what did you have in your mind when you when you uh, were thinking about this? When I was thinking about inside jokes, yeah. well, it was Ned to start. Was it? Uh, yeah, Ned was the first one. Oh uh, well, we, we, that was after it was the uh, the Ethan episode on All Fair. We're like, oh, there's a lot of inside <laughs> jokes going on here. Yeah, yeah. And I was yeah. like, okay, let's 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 bring up some more. Johan so, Capuccelli. Johan. Yeah. Well, you, well, we don't talk about. Well, we do talk about Johan. We can. This is we the... have. We've we've done the Johan thing on air before. This I don't is, know if we have his can... consent to bring him. I mean, we can break the, it down. In the this topic. is the episode. Break it down. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like this is the episode of the show that we would do it on. Talk about Johan. So how'd Johan come about? This is you, who, who Who brought, who brought up Johan? You Johann. did, Yeah, half Johann. of the stupid things are you, buddy. So <laughs> You can't act like, oh, nothing uh, crickets. Nothing. Nothing. Right, yeah. what, so I'll be honest, half you? of the time I don't even get it, oh, but I think right. your guys' reaction is funny, so I go with you it. You got two oh, bowls of soup pretty quick. Yeah. yeah, two bowls of soup. I knew right away one. that was a fucking bit, and I'm like, I'm just going to well, go with it. Well, sometimes it's a situation of, like, how long can we make this? Yeah. I, I think that, okay. That's I'll one have, of my favorite episodes of Off Fair. I'm gonna, it's like every other than the Ethan one, that is the one that I hear about the most. Like yeah. Ethan one now, everyone talks about that. I'm gonna have a quick caveat, but I I think we do a really good job at making like running jokes and creating jo- running yeah. jokes and things that like live on in future episodes and shit like that. Sometimes I think we need to let the dead horse be dead. I think sometimes the horse is dead. It stopped kicking. Flanders besides not Ned, dead. I was going to say besides <laughs> Ned, what are you Flanders, talking about? Flanders I think sometimes dead. the horse is dead. You need no. to let it. Be, <laughs> <laughs> you need to let that dead horse Which die. One? Which one? Uh, I don't know. There's a couple of them. Oh, next time, uh, next time it happens, I'll be like dead Just horse. Call it out. I'll be like dead horse, dead horse. Well, it's gonna be something that you and I really like. Yeah. And he's gonna say that we're gonna be like, <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I don't know. It'll come to me. Shane's got another AI story coming up. Don't worry. Dead horse, dead horse. <laughs> Yeah, we can uh, just call dead horses. I mean, to be fair with how much we talk, we talk about the same things over and over again, but our perspective changes just a Every little bit time. that it seems new. Sometimes, sometimes I think it gets stale. Sometimes it's funny, but I also think that we're creative enough to make new funny Let's running jokes. Burger King, yeah. Did you know that Chris Farley was in uh, the original <laughs> Strike? Yeah, that's, that's, oh, dead yeah, horse, that's another dead one. Horse, dead horse. <laughs> There's another one. What, what were we talking about before? Johan. Johan. Yeah, Johan. Mm-hmm. So I like you, Johan. That's funny. Johan Capicelli. It, this, a lot of these, honestly, I think started like just over Discord calls and shit like that. Yeah. So we will play Fortnite or shit, and we'll just like all get on Discord calls, except for Jake because he hates us and he's touring with Stray. That's you. Uh, he actually just got kicked out of Straper. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I moved down to Metallica. <laughs> he's, he's in minor leagues. Yeah, so. yeah. Uh, I'm with the Foo Fighters. <laughs> But the Foo Fizers. Fizers. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> oh God! Uh, but so so it gets to a point in the night, and especially there was like a big stretch of time where we'd play till like four a.m. and we'd just kind of be bullshitting stuff out. Well, that's where the giggles come out. Yeah, that's the giggle hour. And and so and so at some point we were talking about movies for some reason. I don't even think that we were. Well, you maybe, think it was just very, out of nowhere? It's very possible that we could have been, but from my recollection, you were like. Hey guys, remember this movie? And it was it was Wedding Crashers. It was Wedding Crashers with Johan Capicelli. With Johan Capicelli, what are you doing? He's getting bitch? really into this. I'm dude, gonna, I'm gonna turn at, off the Roblox. No, dude, no, it's, it's a robot giant, visualizer. He's getting chased by a big the, fucking yeah, rat. It's a, a big giant cheese. It's a giant ratatouille. The cameras aren't off. I don't think. I, I know no, they're, they're not. not. No, I know. I'm just. No, this is how I'm he's reacting in it. to this. Really into it. He's into this. I just want to point out that we both looked at each other when it happened. We both were like, "What the? Whoa, dude, he's getting chased by a big fucking rat." It's really reacting. I like it for the for the right audio the listeners. Way. But I like Johan more. I think he's a funny character in so, our okay, world, yeah. in our litany. The bit with Johan was, uh, we were talking. I, I kept bringing up Wedding Crashers with with Vince Johan. Vaughn and Owen Wilson, Johan Capicelli. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I'm I'm going through like the IMDb naming actors that are in, and every so often I throw in Johan Capicelli, <laughs> and it got to the point where Shane's like, "That's not a person." I had, like, yeah, yeah, I had to look it up because I had to look it up online. Well, I looked it up he... too. I and looked it up on Google too. I was like, and is this a nothing guy? comes up. You look up, Yo- you're like, how do you spell Johan? <laughs> By the way, you spell Johan Y O H A N. Like yeah. Yo- Johan. Like Han. Like Zohan, but yeah, with a yeah, Y. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so good. So, and one of my, one definitely one of the best running bits. So I, I sent a uh, picture, n- totally undoctored. Of, of course, the, of, of the course. cover of Wedding Crashers with stock footage of old white guy like peeking around the corner. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. Johan. And I said, that's Johan. That's yeah. him. And he's uh, in there. And you put his name in the... <laughs> in the credit, in yeah. the, the header. Uh, so uh. now the, the bit with that became, 
when you're trying to think of someone's name or like casually slip in like, oh yeah, I saw Star Wars this weekend and Johan uh, Ray Phoenix was in it and so yeah. was Johan Capicelli. Johan yeah. Capicelli played Glub Shitto. Yeah. yeah, right. <laughs> so that's the Johan yeah. Capicelli bit. <laughs> yeah. Gosh. What are some of the Glub Shitto has kind of been one Glub that we've been sh- yeah. saying a lot lately. Yeah. Glub Shitto is just, I don't even know where that, I feel like that's an internet thing. Well, that... Glub Shitto is just a Star Wars meme. Yeah, so right. that there's like a this, fake Star Wars meme? Yeah, because there's this huge Star Wars community and there's all these guys that are like, what, you don't know, you know, they're huge into the lore. They're like, what, you don't remember from scene four and Tatooine and the cantina where Glub Shitto went and talked yeah, to him? Right, they just right. come up with this name. Right, like so, a fake, yeah. okay, whatever, so buddy now, type name. So now there's a wiki page of Glub Shitto. That's so funny. <laughs> yeah, and he's an actual, I really do have to Star say, Wars character now. George Lucas came up with some really funny. Yeah, ma- Qui Gon Jinn is hilarious. Qui Gon Jinn, the the dude from Count Dooku Count is Dooku's also great. hilarious. Come on, uh, San San Hill always made because it's just Sand Hill. That's yeah. all it is. I don't yeah. know why that would fuck. Like, yeah. as a kid, it's that Hank's made me laugh. aunt, right? It is. Yes. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Uh, does Does Jake know the backstory of two bowls of soup? The backstory? I don't, I don't even I don't know if, I know. like, I necessarily... I don't remember why it was two bowls of soup, but... It, so Eric was on that show. Yeah. And we had all gone to get-go to get food before oh, the show. Yeah, and he... Yes, 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 yes. And we're like, we gotta think of something to, to yes. all gang up on Jake on. We gotta think of something to get Jake with, yeah. And I don't know why it was two bowls of soup, but yeah, that's... Yeah, two that's bowls like, of soup at the movies. We all have to casually bring up that we eat two bowls of soup. At the movies, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, they do. And we do for still. my Western listeners. Get goes at gas station. Time. Two bowls of clam chowder <laughs> at the movies. <laughs> I, I think about fucking two bowls of soup all of the time, dude. I I will think of it and just start to laugh. Yeah, it's it's, great. it's a great. That's bit. a pretty good bit. That's a really good bit. Um, there's some other. What are some other bits that we got? We got some Fortnite bits. Maybe we got some more. Yeah, I mean, I got these guys. Battle that are Pass Fortnite. Yeah, and every, every, every yeah, everything oh, needs a battle pass. Battle pass? The, yeah. Everything battle pass. That was a good bit. <clears throat> everything needs a battle pass. It was a great bit. What was that on? What was that from? Uh, we solved all of the world's problems. Yeah, and we used the ba- Fortnite battle yeah. pass for everything. Fortnite yeah. battle pass was the world's problems. Yes. Oh, there's we can go back old. We can go that? back to but we'd like to be. Yeah, that that's a fucking bit. Yeah, in that's, itself. A, yeah. that's a bit we where do. Did, do you want to do you want to say that, where that started? From? That came from Jordan and I when we were in uh ooh. That was in high school. Yeah, that was in high school. I don't even remember what was supposed to be like that. Was it Pepsi? Yeah, that's because we were making a video, but we didn't want to have any. Uh, was it for um, marketing? Was it for this or was it, was it for, for? It was for lithium. I was going to say, or was it yeah, for lithium? It was for lithium, and we were what, wearing wait, band what, shirts. What video was it for? Like, what kind of video was it? It was like a, prom- it was like a promotional thing. It was like a, hmm. was it like meat, meat? us kind of video hmm. well i was wearing a led zeppelin shirt and you were drinking we we're both drinking pepsi and, and that's when evan saw... realized you wanted to get into broadcasting oh we got to because he's yeah. a wacky guy yeah no, i don't so i don't remember what the video was for but it was literally just us sitting on a couch and we both had a they were the pepsi throwback cans but we taped ever, so the, our, our, the only thing we would ever do is so our colors were purple and white mm-hmm. so we, i had purple duct tape and we'd wear band shirts, but we'd tape over the band name and write lithium on it. Mm-hmm. So he was wearing his Led Zeppelin shirt with tape on. I had an ACDC shirt with tape on that said lithium. And we had a Pepsi can. And we're like, oh, well, you know, we'll just tape over the fucking Pepsi thing too and write <laughs> lithium on it. Uh, so at some point, I don't know if you drank Pepsi or I drank Pepsi. It's both of us, I think. We, but but we're, we're not sponsored by Pepsi. But, but we, we like, like to be. be. And yeah. it was just kind of like that. And that's uh, where the video ended. Yeah. And, and it just caught on. Yeah, and then when we when we started doing radio at the school, I don't know why I thought of that at some point. Or like I might have seen it, or maybe it was like close proximity. Yeah. But we started doing that on air, and then we just kept doing it on air. And there used to be a sound effect when we do it in the old podcasts. Yeah. There's like a, uh, which I'm pretty sure was from like a Japanese video game <laughs> of like a training game where you get like something correct to go do 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 do. So I used to put that in after it. Uh, but what's up with the the Ethan call last week? The Ethan call. Oh, oh my the one god! That I, the one was I that called? last week? Uh, last well, last it came out last yeah, week okay. in terms of recording. Oh recording. yeah, dude, that was so funny. Are you like, are you just talking like what in general about it? Like, <laughs> are you talking about my experience that I had of him? Should we, should we clarify about Ethan's hands? I feel like that's yeah, probably Ethan, a good place to Ethan's start. Ethan's hands is definitely an inside joke that like I don't even know if I'm fully in. On. They're big. 
I, but why? Okay, so if I'm not Cause mistaken, because they they're huge, they're big, they're giant, <laughs> they're yeah, fucking why? massive. Dude. Why are they? They big? block out the sun. They no, are, but we don't, like... we don't. We don't ask him. We don't <laughs> ask him. He's sensitive about it. It just happens. Yeah, it just All happened right. one day. Well, he's, I guess. He's yeah, got how big did hands. that? I don't even know how that started. It was because he was so manly. <laughs> That's how it started. Oh yeah. I was oh, I was yeah. saying okay. I think we're playing Minecraft. And his big arms. And yeah. Big, like, and then his big <laughs> hands. I'm like, oh, Ethan's big manly hands from working at the steel mill all day. Or <laughs> and then we just proportion it to be huge, so his hands are massive, dude. Yeah. And now we all sleep in his hands. Yeah. We all <laughs> we all cradle up in him. <laughs> True. I nestle, I nestle myself up in there. They're nice. <laughs> <You> snuggle <laughs> just up at night. Us. It's actually only one hand. Yeah. Too. And we mm-hmm. all like we all could just like snuggle a finger. Honestly. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I'll snuggle one little pad on his finger. Yeah. That's where we all <laughs> yeah. reside. Yeah. Yeah. We have different pads. He truly has the whole world in his hand. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Non alcoholic bars were a bit for a minute. Yeah, non-alcoholic bars were good. That was just from a segment on the show, though. Yeah. That was a full... You guys kept fucking bringing it up, though. <laughs> it was. It was a war. That was a war between the non-alcoholic bars because it seems like something that you would like, and I think... It's stupid. Just at the time... <laughs> it's stupid. It's still stupid. Jules and I were like, why don't you like this? <laughs> like, You need to like this. No, it's dumb, dude. Why would you go to a non-alcoholic bar? What's the point? It was good. I thought it was good. Oh, wait, you actually went? stupid. No, we never went. I oh, just thought it was exactly. like a cool idea. Oh yeah, <clears throat> I thought like, oh, straight edge people would probably like going. To I mean, it makes like sense. This. Or it's people, dumb. no, people who are in know, Alcoholics Anonymous. Yeah, right. That's would who it's probably for. Like it. Yeah, that's who it's I'm made for. I'm not an alcoholic, so I don't want to go to a non-alcoholic bar. Well, you're anonymous. So. You're an anonymous alcoholic. I'm an anonymous. You are. You're so an anonymous wanna... alcoholic. <laughs> I'm part of anonymous. <laughs> And you're an alcoholic. And I'm an alcoholic, but yeah. I keep them very separate. Of course. I yeah. keep my work life and my professional life very separate. Of course. What it's other what other, like that. Yeah. What other personal bits are there? Well, there was the we started with Ethan talking about the Ethan story that oh, I yeah. called with. So on the last off air episode, I had that call in at the end where I talked about how he was rolling around <laughs> on the slug like a floor. Yeah. And that's how I got into radio. I want to do voices. <laughs> yeah, what was going on on that? I got a question. I was in the yeah. store. We were dying, uh, by the way. It was yeah. just the most random phone call. Like you started you started going off on a tangent. It was it so funny. Like. Well, what freaked me out because I, I never like knew your full name. I just know you as Pidge. Yeah. So there you go, what's up, Seven? So like, <laughs> so we get done with everything, and I see it pop up, and I'm like, "Who the hell is that?" <laughs> so I just send it to voicemail, not thinking anything of it. Then I listen. And you're like, "Hey, hey, it's Evan." Uh, you know, I was talking, I was thinking about, and then I'm like, I'm like, "Oh, okay." And then we had just gotten done talking about him, and then the fact that you just went off on the stand, and I'm like, "What the fuck is happening?" <laughs> so then. In my head, cause, you know, sometimes when we do off air, he'll do it on like Discord. Yeah. And, then, yeah. and I'm like, was this on Discord? Was he he's listening like, in? Yeah. He's like, no, no. I'm like, there's no way <laughs> this is just random how this happened. Yeah. And the fact that it was, and then you thought Shane was me when he yeah. yelled at you on the phone. Yeah, I, th- yeah, I thought, yeah. I did a pretty good job. I thought what it was. I, I thought it was you doing a, like a voice. <laughs> Shane, Shane, can we get your Jake impression real quick? Yeah. Hey, I'm Jake. I don't know. That's that's that's, that's not, it. That's, not what he <laughs> that, that's exactly it. it. That was pretty much it. Yeah, I that's think. pretty close. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty much wow. how he sounds. Honestly, I did good. That's yeah, why you're in the so. cabinet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Closet's too big. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in the drawer. When, in the when can we drawer. when can we break the striper bit? And not for a while. Okay. Yeah. No, there's an NDA. So uh, I, I figured oh, yeah. as much. I yeah. kind of yeah. figured. Um, that makes sense to me. Yeah. G- give it a little bit because right now, right now, <laughs> like I'm, like well, years. No, not years. Okay. I, I, yeah. No, when we can, I'll make sure because right now, technically, I'm in two other bands along with that band. That's so right. we're just That's yeah. right. we're just touring. You're doing a lot of a lot yeah. of touring with those yes. bands. A lot of session. Work. I did some yeah. touring today. So yeah. 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 You know, I just I've been very curious about Striper, you know, the bands and how they're playing. The Stripe. The Stripe. Um, the local bands are great. <laughs> I'm talking um, about the the well, national bands. I'm talking about the national band, the the b- very famous historically. Well, I mean, band. there's there's two of those. Um, the both big, the big family band. 
the f- yeah, the family band. <laughs> Once again, I mean, it's... Wow. it's oh, yeah, there's two of those. You know... <laughs> there's two uh, of those. This, this episode's both, about... <laughs> both bands are very this, good. This episode's about talking about the inside jokes. And not making it far more confusing. <laughs> you just made it so, <laughs> yeah. 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 Just made it so both, much. Both bands are great. Be- people right. in, people right. in like Arizona are like, what right. the fuck are right. you talking about? What band about? is this? Is but I mean, we... Here, here, here's a here's a hint. Here's a hint. Phoenix is a beautiful city. We were there, you know, within the last two weeks. Okay, strike bands were there. When this uh, podcast comes out next month, I'm sure that'll be great. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there you go. You got the context. Find it. There you go. go. Those in Phoenix in early September, you'll know. There you go. (laughs) (laughs) That word there. I I got in that rental car and it said 109 up at the Mm -hmm. top, and I'm like, how the fuck do they do this? Yeah, yeah. It's hot, dude. Yeah, like. Well, I don't live Ugh. in Phoenix. But I live near it. It wasn't. Well, it wasn't just Phoenix that was that oh, hot. It yeah. was everywhere. It's all hot. Yeah. You live in that crack. I live in the crack. Yeah, the that's crack. another bit. That's not a bit. You live in the crack. Well, no, that's another thing y'all talk about is saying that. Yeah, he lives in a crack. Yeah, the it's fact like, that yeah. you live in Arizona <laughs> in and of itself is just a bit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a good bit. Arizona itself has become a bit. Yeah. To the point where, like, we did a story today about Arizona unknowingly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. A woman died in a bank in Arizona. <laughs> There's a lot of news that oh. y'all report, and it happens from Arizona. It's just a thing. I know you don't have control over that. Yeah. Because what else do you do in a big hole in the ground? Yeah, right. Yeah. It's all a big hole. So I think it's content. just because we we want to see you. We want to hang out with yeah. you. Yeah. So he hates like, us. That's he what it is. Yeah. No, right. He just hates us. Yeah. So, yeah. I live in a bit. I live in a ditch. I live in the big. I live ditch. at the Grand Canyon, the big ditch. That's true. So the big that's ditch in the sky. Paul Bunyan made that when he was wrestling with his blue ox. Mm. Hey, Blinken invented the choke slam. That's true. That is. It's I a true know. story. It's All crazy. Right. Just wanna <laughs> drop that little <laughs> just wanna drop a little knowledge bomb on you. Can't say you didn't learn anything today. Yeah, it's the truth. Know, that's something. Yeah. Well, Evan, you got about a minute. <laughs> I got about a minute left. Okay. I guess I'll finish this up. How long does it usually go? Twenty four minutes? Twenty five. I'm I'm the host. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Twenty five minutes. Okay. Um this is a pigeonhole. Submit your stuff into the Styles of Radio Discord page. It was fun. We will, or I will, review the stuff that you give me next year. Not next, next month. year. Yeah, next year. Fuck well, you guys. Next year too. <laughs> but episode one hundred. Right, yeah. <laughs> On my left is Style. Bit. Peace. Right is Shane. Bye everyone. Far right is Jake. Goodbye everybody. Off air. Very off nice. air. Styles of Radio. Check it out. W S R. I'm not I'm not on off air. <laughs> you are on off air. Apparently not. I'm just no, on the not. website itself. No, you're yeah. <laughs> you're 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 one of the blog guys. Yeah, I'm just the blog guy. <laughs> yeah. Find me wherever you find me. Yeah. Find, find me in the streets. Yeah. Find me in the streets. Find, Catch me outside, yeah, find us on it. styles You know you don't have TikTok. to use that anymore, right? I don't. You can just say W S R R radio. W- okay. Yeah. W S R R radio dot com. Live 365 you to, app. You don't have to legally name it anymore. Yeah. Live 365 app. Yeah. Check us out. Yeah. So listen to some kick-ass music. I know oh. when I'm driving a, a can around the can. Hey, wait. Do I we like have, to listen to it. Do we have one more minute? It's way more why than is, a minute. Why does the show end with Drunken Sailor? <laughs> oh, because I'm a pirate. Yeah, he is. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He's not he the Because I'm, I'm a big shanty guy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's the reason. Shanties, shanties, and more shanties for this guy over here. Trust me, I would know. I'm a cowboy. <laughs> Shane is a cowboy. That's another that? one that we didn't. <laughs> yeah, it's not a bit. That's not a bit. people that cowboy. disagree. I'm people that listen to off air. I endorse Shane being a cowboy. Yeah, I'm just a cowboy. Jake's the only one here that can endorse anyone, and we know that. <laughs> because he's and he because endorses he's me as a cowboy. Striper. He tours with Striper. <laughs> he tours with Striper. <laughs> striper and Metallica. That's me. <laughs> 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 All right, wrap this thing up. All right, peace. How's Striper going? <laughs> it's great. <laughs>